So today we're working on four variations of teep kicks. First kick is to teep in range with very little movement. The second kick is to step with the rear foot, replacing the lead foot. Wall a step and then rotate for more reach. Watch how the back foot pivots. Engage your hips by leaning back. For longer range, you're going to need to skip as you kick. If your toes are behind your knee, then you're only engaging your quadriceps. Here is a great drill to work on your balance and technique. Throw your first kick, then bring it back to position with your knee in line with your hip then kick again. After your second kick, you may put your foot down. Work on your balance by keeping your head in between your shoulders. You can rotate, or you can do it from a stationary position. Remember, a majority of the power comes from your core and not your quadriceps. You can lean back for a little bit more power. However, if you lean back too far, you will lose balance and power. One of my favorite conditioning drills for teeps is to teep for speed. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Make sure to do both legs and alternate. 10 on the left, then 10 on the right. Work your way down to 1. 